Hey everyone, it's Kato, and in this video, we're visiting the island of Galapagos, created by Bunny. Uh, she said her general theme is an ancient civilization founded by gnomes who were there long before Tom Nook moved in. They have a fondness for human art, literature, and sculptures, which can be found all over the island. It's a mix of cottage core and fairy core with a few modern twists. That sounds amazing, and I'm so excited to see this island. All right, here we are. All right, so first off, yellow airports are my favorite, so I'm jealous that she has the yellow airport. Oh, there she is. Hello. Welcome. Thank you so much for having me. I'm so excited to see your island. Your entrance is beautiful. Look at all the flowers. I love the purple one flowers. All right, so we're going to start off by going up this ramp to the left here. Oh, and here are her Nooks and Abel sisters. Look at these windflowers here, and I love these dresses. I've never seen dresses like that before. They're so pretty. I like those a lot. I like that cottage core dress over there too. Oh, and before I forget, let me look at the map really quick. So it looks like she has all of her villagers in the back, and red is here, which is super exciting. But let's see who her villagers are. It looks like she has Sky. Marshall, Deirdre, Bo, Alice, Anna, Blue Bear, Sherb, Diana, and Sally. So she has some good villagers. Oh, it's so pretty. The entrance is so nice with all the waterfalls. I love those little fruit boxes up there next to Nooks. I didn't even see those at first. So many statues. Ooh, look, potions and elixir section. This is so cute. Like a little cauldron here. So many little potions. I love the simple panels back there and I love this wedding fencing that she used. I would never think to use that. Oh, look at this little table here. I wonder if I can sit. Oh, there we go. This is so cute with the little gnome having a little tea party. I love that. I can't get over how many statues she has. I think I have one statue, maybe two. Ooh, look at this. Okay, I love this. This is like a little greenhouse area all the different plants and of course her little gnome there on the mushroom there's that dress again I love that this is so pretty these right here are my favorite plants these anthuriums they're so pretty oh I love these little patterns on the floor here too those are so cute all right look at all the purple flowers wow she has so many bug models everywhere. Oh, I missed the ramp. I'm coming. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Okay, so some black roses. This is pretty. Oh, look, a little chessboard. And the thinking man statue. It's so cute. grasshopper statue over there. This is so nice. Is this like a little mushroom forest? All of the little gnomes. I always lose. Oh, she always loses in chess. That's so cute. I love that. I love how it's elevated. It's so pretty. All right, we've got a little well over here, the simple well, I love that. And a little seating area. I love these benches. Let me try to take a picture here. This is so nice. Oh. Oh, and of course my eyes are closed as always. There we go. That's so pretty. 
Look at the little ducks up there. I love those ducks. <gasps> oh, look. A little secret area. Leading to Red's Beach. This is so cute. I love this. Look at all the little gold stacks. This is so nice. And the art. And that little gnome right there on the barrel. He's so cute. I love the bells on the ground. This is such a cool area. Smuggler's Cove. Yeah, I love it. So neat. And I love that it's actually secret. Like, I would never think to come back here if she hadn't led me back here. That's so pretty. All right. I think this is her house. And she said that the inside of her house wasn't finished yet. So I'm going to kindly stay out. But I love the outside. I love to see what people do with the outside of their houses. Because I never know which combinations of doors and um, shingles and the exterior. I never know what looks good. I feel like a lot of times the colors don't really match. Um, but I really like the outside of hers. Alright, so here's a little library. I love this. So cute. Little seating areas. So many bookshelves. This is so pretty. And a little music section. Let me see if I can play something. I'm so bad at playing the instruments. Oh, there we go. Oh, look. A little band. I love the harp, too. It's so pretty. This is so nice. Look at the little pond up there. I love this. Alright, we've got a little bamboo section over here. And a little eating area. That's so cute. I don't think I've ever seen anyone use these tables. I think these are like the imperial dining tables. They're really nice. I love this little section. Oh, and she has the golden lucky cat. Jealous. There's a little villager housing area. This is so pretty. Oh, I love that sofa there with the mushroom table. I would never think to put those together, but I really like that. A little tiny library. Another little mushroom table. This is so cute. Sorry, excuse me. We'll go this way. Oh, that just is overlooking everything. Okay. Let me find her again. There she is. I seriously love this house so much. Whose house is this again? Deirdre's house. She has one of the best houses. It's so pretty. Oh, look at this. Little painting gnomes. They're so cute. Art class. Wow. You have some talented gnomes on your island. To be painting the Mona Lisa and all these other art pieces. <laughs> that is adorable. Who's this? Sky's house. That's another pretty house and I love that brick pattern. More villager houses, there's Sherv's house, and a little stargazing area. This is so cute. The waterfalls. I love her terraforming. So pretty. I love all the purple flowers too. She has so many roses. We're going to head to the beach over here. And what is this? <laughs> uh oh, I'm kind of scared. Oh, wow. She has like a little throne back here. I'm kind of confused. I need, I need an explanation for this. Is it your throne? Is it a gnome's throne? 
What is it for? I love it though. I love the Lily of the Valley leading up to it. <laughs> I love the shark statue. This is so cute. Her own little throne. <laughs> That's funny. And I like these statues right here. Those are cool. I've never seen those before. Oh, look. She just came out of her house. All right. So let's keep going. Got some cosmos. Oh, look. Oh, it's like a little science class. They're like investigating the fossils or learning about fossils. This is so cute. Look at him, with his little turtle. Look at all of them. They're so precious. She's got a little seat stool for herself right there. That is so cute. I love all the gnomes. Especially that one with the little black outfit. He's so cute. Okay, and then she's got the shell stuff. This is really pretty. Is this like a custom um, colorway for the shell stuff? I think it is because I know that I've seen the shell fountain in a different colorway, so I assume all of the other shell stuff can be customized too. I've just never tried it. I don't think I've ever used any of the other shell items. I love this little leaf pile. gonna head back and pass by here passing the little potions and elixirs area this is so pretty oh look I love this colorway of this piano it's one of my favorites it's like the street piano it's so cute and a little diner I love this with the mint Diner furniture, this is so pretty. And I love that bridge over the waterfall back there. It's so nice. This is so cute. Oh, look, we're in sync. <laughs> That's adorable. And I love when people use this gas pump. I love that version and I want to use it so bad. I lost her. Oh, there you are, okay. Sorry, I got distracted. Easily distracted. Okay, and here is her orchard. This is so pretty. Let's see how many of each fruit she has. Looks like she has four of each. It's a good amount. And I love when people use these fruit baskets in front of the orchards. It's so cute. I love that. Okay, and then we got some more villager houses. That's a nice house right there. These are so cute. And a little patio for Marshall. I think that's Marshall. This is so nice. I love the fall weeds over there. They're so pretty. Oh, look at the little moon in the background. Whoa, that's a big... I didn't even notice that bug. Um statue there, the dragonfly. That's huge. Oh. Aw, and then she has a little watermelon farm and a little lavender in the back. That's so pretty. This is so nice. Oh, <laughs> can't stop sitting on the cushions. This is so cute. She has so many different styles of environments. Look at this little picnic area and look at that space section in the back. This is so cool. I love this pattern of blanket too. So pretty. I didn't even know you could customize the mum cushion to be red. I knew you could do yellow and white. This is so nice. All right, so let's keep following her. And she's got a little seating area down here. And then, oh, look at her little campsite. 
This is so cute. It's very quaint. I like this. I like how she has it dug into the cliff back there. Just kind of nestled in. That's so nice. I need to do my campsite more like this on my new island. I feel like I try to go totally overboard with my campsites and they get to be ridiculous. It's just too much. Oh wow, look at this. I love this. This is like a little bar area with all the different stools and the little podiums used as a bar. This is so cute. And little fireplaces turn backwards. This is one of my favorite areas. I like this a lot. I love all the brown. So pretty. This is so cool. What is that? A little, like a swordfish or something? still can't get over the bug models that she has. And those simple panels are really nice. Is that a custom pattern or is it in the game? Look at this. The little rainbow garden. This is so pretty. Look. It's so nice. I want to go that way. And a little wedding area. Sorry, I got distracted by flowers. This is so cute. I love that pattern on the ground. The little clovers and that statue in the background. That's my favorite statue. Cute little reception area. So pretty. And this pattern really looks good in bulk like that, all next to each other. It almost just looks like a different version of the grass. Okay, back to the flowers. These are so pretty. And another little music area. And then, wow, a little rainbow area around her fountain. I love that. Look, it's so cute. And then a little bakery with the little cakes. This is so nice. She's got the little laptop out here. I've never seen someone put a laptop outside, but I like that. It's a little coffee shop, cafe that you can do your homework or do your work on. That's so nice. This is so pretty. I love all the different types of bushes. I didn't know that the holly bushes were in season in the fall. I thought they were in the winter, but. Oh look, a little band section. I'm so bad at playing the instruments. I can never get in front of them, so I'm just gonna sing. Well, I'm gonna sing in the game. I'm not gonna sing in real life because you guys don't wanna hear that, but just imagine me singing. This is so cute. I still can't play the guitar. <laughs> It's like I can't stand in front of it to play it. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at this little picnic area. I love this. With the little mums on the blankets, that's so cute. Music fest. That's so nice. I've never been to a music festival. I think it would be too hot. <laughs> Too many people, but I like that idea. A little dig site with all the fossils, that's so cute. And then here's her museum. This is so nice. With all the different statues and then the little fossils up there. So pretty. I like the mushroom lamps too and all the waterfalls. But wait. Okay. So she has her staircase. And it's two spaces. Right? The staircase is two spaces. And then her entrance is three spaces. 
But why does it look like, when I come down here, why does it look like it's centered up correctly? Am I losing my mind? I don't know. It looks good. I love that. And then she has another little seating area on the beach here. I love these pillows. I love the white birch customization of this furniture. It's so cute. And a little ukulele on the table. It's so cute. Alright, I think we're headed back towards the entrance here. I don't know if she has anything else for us to see. Oh. Okay, maybe one more thing. Oh, a little cafe area. On her beach right by the airport. This is so cute. I love it. I love that Lily record player too. This is so nice. I think that's everything. Thank you so much for having me. Your island was so pretty. If you guys enjoyed the video, I'd love it if you would like and subscribe. And again, I'll have all of her information, the custom patterns and her Instagram in the description below. And I'll see you next time.